What is up guys, your boy Mooney here coming at you guys with another Battlefield video. Today we're going to be playing some Battlefield 2042. Um, I think I put about 120 hours into this game, probably a little bit less. Yeah, I wanted to make a video on this game and I wanted to say this game is a little bit of a mess. I do enjoy playing this game when I don't have anything else to play. It's just fun to like just run around and run around and uh, just kill people but today i'm going to be using a controller and playing this game i've been really enjoying controller on on battlefield lately especially on battlefield 42 but i feel like the aim it like i don't know i just find it very relaxing just sitting back and just destroying people these are my settings for for my controller uh usually it's the dead zone is a lot lower but I have no like there's just so many settings in this game and it's just so confusing usually it's I have it at 10 to 10 but usually my dead zone in other games is a lot lower in apex in apex legends and in uh, modern warfare 2 it is a crap ton lower and it's almost I think it's like my dead zones in both those I think it's like 0.01 on controller I really enjoy using a higher higher sense or a higher uh, and a lower uh dead zone so uh, i think i'm gonna try it i think if i just match both of them should give me what i want i think that is correct i wanted to make a video on this game because i think this game could have done well if dice just put more time into it and just fixed the damn bugs it launched with because once again, when you launch a Battlefield game, for whatever reason, the launch is absolutely terrible and you lose half the fucking player base. I was thinking they were going to make it free to play or at least make it go on Game Pass. I know it went on Game Pass. I know it went on Game Pass, I think, two weeks ago. And the player base actually jumped up. But the number of players that were actually playing this game actually jumped up. And it was just a ton of fun playing with a lot more people on these giant maps so i'm really hoping they do bring it to game pass and and hopefully it gets another spike of uh players i enjoy battlefield like i said in my last video in battlefield one i enjoy battlefield what the fuck happened did it crash then the game crashed oh my god for whatever reason, I've been getting I've been getting a lot of problems with Battlefield 2042. Right there, we ordered into a match and then it crashed. For then, I had to reinstall I had to reinstall the whole entire game, and then when it got to the loading screen, it just kept crashing for absolutely no reason. All right, guys, we are back. Um, I had to restart my whole computer to see if it would allow me to actually play the goddamn game. It decided to just crash when loading into the game. Like I said before, I had this problem when I tried launching the game. Yeah, the stupidest bug ever. Let's try booting the game. Or not booting. Let's try loading into another game and seeing if it works. All right. Canals again. Please don't crash. You have no reason to crash, game. Literally no reason. Okay, it didn't crash. Excellent. Go. Let's go with the AK. Go on D1. See if it actually works. All right, so it works. Great. Like I was saying before, somebody actually, like, somebody looked up the numbers, mouse and keyboard versus controller. And for whatever reason, controller, controller has 20% less recoil in this game. I don't know how true it is, but that's actually pretty, that's actually pretty wild. That is true. Only reason why I play controller in this game is because I get, I get bored very easily. And when a game also lacks content, I try to make my own content and I try to have fun. But yeah, I'm, I am 100% a mouse keyboard player, but sometimes I like plugging in the old... God damn, Tank, I'm dead, bro. Fuck. I 100% think that in this Battlefield game, aim assist is connected to the scopes. So whatever scope you're running on your weapon, I feel like it's either less aim. Oh, Jesus. It's either less aim assist or there's more. And it might just be with like how this, how much the scope like zooms in and stuff. I 100% feel that way about aim assist in this game. We have enemies attacking Alpha 1. 
Yeah. I'm dead. He sees me. Oh my god, I tried. I tried sneaking. But apparently, he probably he heard me swim towards him. That's some audio that Warzone 2 needs. I am that maniac that literally just. There you go. What's up, Call of Duty? Just to play shipment because it's just so much easier and so and so brain dead and you really just don't have to think you just run into a person in like 0 0.02 seconds and it's just so much better people can't camp in freaking corners see how it sticks sometimes i don't know oh the aim assist 100 percent like sticks sometimes and doesn't stick it's just the weirdest thing ever in this game I think this future right here for Battlefield is probably one of the best things they ever came up with where you can literally edit your loadout on the fly and then just have attachments on the go. It's, it's unrealistic, but it's just a really cool freaking concept to have. Like when you think about it, well, I never been to war. So no, no, but like I never been to war, but like imagine like about to go into a gunfight and just being able to change your barrel to a long barrel so you can somehow so you can shoot people at longer ranges or put like a muzzle on your gun in the middle of the battle the cool concept i'll give you that battlefield i'll give you that i haven't been playing a lot of 2042 but i'm actually might come back and play it a lot more there isn't really much to play call of duty has not been getting a lot of updates and fixes and Warzone 2 has been in shambles and none of my friends want to play that game so you know what might you know just chill back and just play this game because what else is there to play i did buy sekiro so i might actually make a series on that you guys can leave it in the comments down below tell me if you guys want me to make a, a series on it probably stream it and record it at the same time and chop it up and make a video for you guys I just don't know how I'm going to, um, like, how I'm going to do it, in a sense. Like, how to, how I'm going to edit the videos. Because I, th I think that game is pretty long. Oh, I'm dead. That's a freaking tank. That's a tank! 